सदाशिव शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्यपर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा नैष्कर्म्य सिद्धि सेकेंड चैप्टर पेज नंबर सिक्सटी सेवन वेर्स फिफ्टी एट इंट्रडक्षन अज्ञानोत्थबुद्धियाधि आत्मा परिगृह्य अन्वय व्यतिरेकाभ्या अहम सुखी दुखी चहंकारा देहे अनात्मधर्म उत कलात्माभ्युपगमे अशक्यवाच अथ इदानी अविद्या परिकल्पित साक्षि आश्रित्य कर्तृत्वाद्यशेष परिणाम प्रतिषेधाय आह वी आर सीइंग दैट द टॉपिक ऑफ दृक दृश्य विवेक एज द फर्स्ट स्टेज ऑफ लर्निंग and sakshi saksha viveka as the second stage of learning in initial stages shastra introduce atma as the druk principle the observer and anatma the world body mind as an anatma principle as drishyam objective universe including the body mind complex so drug drishya viveka sakshi sakshya viveka sakshi means the chaitanyam the witness consciousness these two stages when we are studying shastra analyze further what is druk what is drishyam drishyam is uh, an object of experience every object is called drishyam the drishya prapancha is mithya any object experience whatever you have is mithya only unreal only false only that is called drishyam yat yat drishyate tat tat mithya drishyatvat ghatavat whatever is seen yat yat drishyate whatever is seen or observed or experienced that and all come under drishyam tat tat drishyam what is the reason hetu the hetu is um, drishyatvat because it is observed by me or because it is seen by me or because it is uh, experienced by me yat yat drishyate tat tat mithya drishyatvat like what how can you say it is mithya like ghatavat like a pot like a cloth any object just as you see anything in this world including your body mind complex also so this is the allah this druk and drish when we are talking very important subtle subject to internalize the vedantic teaching 
to claim one's own nature. This is the crux of uh, Vedanta to internalize the or to it, assimilate the fact which we are taking as the mind body as ourself Shastra beautifully present you what you are thinking about yourself that is not really you are in Druk observer there are two types of observers there are two types of experiencers one is changing experiencer another is non-changing experiencer there are two those who study Shastra alone they come to know about the two I I means I am whenever we say I am there are two types of I am Normally in the world, people, all ignorant people, they know I am means only lower I they know. They do not know the words lower I or higher I. <clears throat> they may not know the words. If they know the words are not, does not mean, doesn't um, bother, hmm? we don't bother about that. But what people understand about themselves is ahankara I, lower I. When you come to know that Mahavakya study, then you understand there is another I that is higher I. That higher I and lower I both are very very close, proximate, very difficult to decipher to separate physically. That is why people commit a mistake. Ahankara is that the Chidabhasa, I the I, higher I, the OC, original consciousness, lend existence and consciousness, the Chidabhasa, the reflected consciousness I lend. Lending within inverted commas. There is no literally lending. Like lending 100 rupees, lending 200 rupees, 1000 rupees. It's not physically lending. Then what do you mean by lending? I, the higher I, the Sakshi Chaitanyam, the pure consciousness, original consciousness, oh see, in my presence, the mind, antahkaranam, gets that uh, chidabhasa, the reflected consciousness. The mind, antahkaranam, gets the chidabhasa, the reflected consciousness in my presence. I don't lend anything. There is no literally borrowing, literally lending. In my presence, mind becomes sentient because of the formation of Chidabhasa, the reflected consciousness. Just like in the mirror, your original face reflects. Are you doing anything to reflect your reflected face in the mirror? In the presence of original face, when the medium mirror is available, automatically the original face gets reflected in the mind, in the mirror, there in the mirror, Drishtanta. Really speaking, the mirror also is not borrowing the reflected face into it. So therefore I say borrowing and lending, please don't take them as literally, in literal sense. Whenever we use the words, we have to be very, very cautious. Lending, borrowing, all these are only figurative expressions. As though lending, as though borrowing. Just like a water, when sun reflects in the waters. Water is not borrowing the reflection, sun is not lending the reflected sun in that. 
in the presence of sun lord sun suryaha the water medium reflecting medium is there the sun reflects that's all it happens similarly here also in the mind upadhi buddhyaadi that upadhi buddhi aadi padat prana sense organs etc the entire sukshma shariram the commentator says buddhi aadi padat antah karanam sense organs are included prana is included all become sentient then what happens sentient mind because of chidabhasa then mind gets the capacity to observe the world external world so the mind has become the experiencer that is why it is called pramata when you include in oc in the mind you include it becomes pramata the observer the lower i that is called lower i inferior i ahankara i pramata i when you include the mind pramata i ahankara i am when we say that is lower i lower i the mind included chidabhasa sahita manaha become sentient capable of observing the world external universe once the universe becomes an objective universe for this mind chidabhasa sahita antah karanam becomes the ahankara becomes the ahankara is called i there i am that is called lower i false i mithya i inferior i so reflected consciousness in the upadhi buddhyaadi in this paragraph so then that mind becomes drik drik and what type of drik that is mind antakaranam is changing medium so chidabhasa is in the changing medium therefore that drik is called changing drik always savikara drik it has got modifications so the experience or one is a changing one lower i lower i inferior i is a changing one savikara drik drik number 1 what is drishyam for that drik world is the drishyam world is the drishyam the objective universe now this is the first episode la first part first part means what drik drishya viveka drik drishya viveka first episode first episode first part is lower i the mind antakarana sahita chidabhasa becomes that i am it utters i experience the world i observe the world i am the knower of the world pramata that all belongs to the lower i drik number 1 or seer number 1 this is what generally people take as the real i but as an advanced students you are all naishkart me siddhi students i can call all of you as senior students because of long uh, study of these uh, upanishads and uh, prakrana granthas you are able to understand especially upadesa sahasri panchadashi what we saw many other prakrana granthas this lower i is blessed by the higher i now the second part of first episode that is drik drishya viveka we have to go real drik is not the ahankara real drik is not the origin 
not the inferior I, ahankara I. Real drukhi is not a changing I, changing ahankara, changing mind, changing thoughts. It is not the real I. Then what is the real drukh? What is the real I? That which is blessing the lower I, the ahankara blessed by the, the chidabhasa, the one who is the blesser. The blesser is, the blessed one is um, drukh number one. Blessed by whom? O C. O means original. C means consciousness. Original consciousness. So, original consciousness is called Sakshi Chaitanyam. What is the difference between this original consciousness and reflected consciousness? Reflected consciousness is a changing consciousness. Changing. The medium changes, the reflection also changes. Original consciousness will not change. If your mirror is a concave mirror, your reflected face appears differently. If it is a convex mirror, your reflected face appears differently. Whereas the original face really it is unchanging. The change in your reflected face is because of mirror. Similarly here also, OC will never change, that is Sakshi Chaitanyam. Real Drik, second Drik, Drik number two, seer number two, or experiencer number two, or observer number two. This observer number two, or Drik number two, or um, the experiencer number two, Drik is called Sakshi Chaitanyam. Ever the experience experiencer never the experienced. This Sakshi Chaitanyam OC real Druk I am is ever the same never changing that is this Druk number 2. Druk number 2. What is this lesson? Episode number 1, Drik Drishya Viveka, episode number 1, part number 2. So, Sakshi Chaitanyam, original consciousness. I am. I am not Ahankara. Mind included Ahankara, I am not. That is why in Nirvana Shatkam, Mano Buddhya Ahankara Chit. Naham. When you include the Mano Buddhi Chitta Hankara, that is lower I, it is not me. That is not my real nature. That is Vyavaharika I. Who am I then? I am Paramarthika I, the Sakshi Chaitanyam, the original I. Druk number two. Who is witnessing that lower I also. What is the um, greatness or superiority of this uh, higher I, OC, Sakshi Chaitanyam? One uh, difference is it is non-changing. I Nidruk, OC, Sakshi Chaitanyam am non-changing. Parinama Rahitaha without any change. And I am the Druk, I have the mind as Drishyam. The Druk number one, the Antakarana Sahita Manaha, low, lower I become the Drishyam. For me, the Druk number two. Therefore, since Druk number two, I, the original consciousness, am Sakshi Chaitanyam, the real I, ever the same, never changing, never the experienced, 
but ever the experiencer never the illumined but ever the illuminator drk number 2 i am when i am there ever the experiencer ever the illuminator ever the observer never the observed nor illumined i the original consciousness in front of me that drk number 1 will become what drishyam this is the crucial lesson crucial point drk number 1 has uh, got two roles what role drk number 1 from the standpoint of the world it is uh, the subject it is the observer it is the experiencer it is the knower from the standpoint of the world drishyam but when you come to the drik number 2 from that standpoint this drik number 1 i the sakshi chaitanyam observe all my emotions all my emotions in vichara sagara we are seeing now all emotions are observed antakarana vrittis thought modifications are all observed by me the ever changing ever never changing ever the experiencer never the experienced i the drik number 2 i am ever the drik never the drishyam but drik number 1 the antakarana manaha lower i he is playing double role from the standpoint of the world drishya prapancha drishtya drik number 1 is uh, drik number 1 is the subject but from the standpoint of drik number 2 the mind lower i is drishyam lower i is from paramarthika i the sakshi chaitanyam higher i the lower i is drishyam so the mind anta kanupadesa sahasri we saw elaborately this but the since it is very crucial point i am deliberately repeating again and again so that you all can contemplate and assimilate easily so this uh, drik number 2 is ever the drik never the drishyam drik number 1 is uh, sometimes drishyam sometimes drik sometimes means from the standpoint of drishyam world that is uh, the drik from the standpoint of original consciousness sakshi chaitanyam i am higher i that lower i is the drishyam this is the subject matter episode number 1 is over now this is uh, what shastra says we think this is a great teaching wonderful excellent highest teaching shastra says no it is lkg teaching for ukg like then what is highest teaching episode number 2 you have to go drik and drishyam the stage is only for initial beginners we introduce drik drishya viveka we have to go to sakshi sakshya viveka sakshi sakshya viveka because drik drishya alone you take up there that ahankara is also playing a drik role why we have to go to episode number 2 drik drishya viveka is episode number 1 there are two parts we are not holding on to that that is only initial teaching we are telling and it is appointing the student also after teaching long time but what to do we have to come to the higher i sakshi chaitanyam higher i the real i that is sakshi sakshya viveka we have to come 
we don't want to hold on to that drik drikshya because mind ahankara sahita manaha lower i is becoming drishyam therefore why i have to hold on to that come to the second episode called sakshi chaitanyam higher i sakshi chaitanyam higher i without this upadhi mind antakaranam sakshi cannot sakshi cannot play the role saksham and sakshi it's no prayojanam that is what we were seeing kevalatma abhyupadame only pure original consciousness if you take without buddhi chitta ahankara prana sense organs medium without that ashakyatvat original consciousness cannot just like without mirror without mirror your original face cannot be seen there is no prayojanam you cannot keep bindi you cannot do any alankarana properly without what medium that medium alone is used here as buddhi adi upadhi kartrutva sa kartrutva upadhim atmanam parigrihya eva taking that atma by taking this uh, sukshma sharira antakarana mana buddhi chitta ahankara abhyupagami ashakyatvat original consciousness is of no use phala abhavachya therefore atha idanim avidya parikalpitam deliberately parikalpitam we superimpose we superimpose because of avidya ignorance superimpose ignorance caused superimposition we deliberately take accept shastra accepts sakshitvam the sakshi status sakshi hood tvam how you uh, translate in english sakshitvam witness hood witness hood sakshitvam akshritya how the sakshitvam has come to the original consciousness how the sakshitvam witness hood has come unless there is a witnessed object witness hood cannot come to the oc listen carefully witness witnessed object sakshyam is not there the mind body complex is not there chitta ahankara prana sense organs are not there upadhi is not there sakshyam that is sakshyam drik number 1 is not there this uh, drik number 2 who is really called as sakshi that sakshitvam status witness hood awareer awareness chaitanyam real i higher i not fake i fake i is lower i fake i is taken and its upadhis are taken ashritya having taken the support of support of whom mind buddhi sensor gan suprana sensukshma shariram complete package kartrutvaadi asesha parinamah kartrutva doership enjoyership aadi padat bhoktrutva kartrutvaadi asesha entire parinama modification the doer is not eater eater is not sleeper sleeper is not singer singer is not walker walker is not uh, hmm? um uh, whatever e r u c add no all these actions are parinama they are all changing kartrutva bhoktrutva is changing you are enjoyer of uh, happy feelings you are enjoyer of uh, uh, sad feelings also enjoy means what experiencing all those parinama changing pair of opposites 
ರಾಗ ದ್ವೇಷ ಕಾಮ ಕ್ರೋಧ ಜಯ ಅಪಜಯ ದ್ವಂದ್ವ ಪರಿಣಾಮ ಕರ್ತೃತ್ವಾದಿ ಅಶೇಷ ಪರಿಣಾಮ ಪ್ರತಿಷೇಧಾಯ ದೇರ್ ಆಲ್ ಫಾಲ್ಸ್ ಮಿಥ್ಯಾ ಪ್ರತಿಷೇಧಾಯ ಟು ನೆಗೇಟ್ ಟು ಫಾಲ್ಸಿಫೈ ದಮ್ ಈವೆನ್ ದೋ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ವ್ಯಾವಹಾರಿಕ ಪ್ರಪಂಚ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕಮಂಡರ್ ವ್ಯಾವಹಾರಿಕ ಮಾಯಾ ಇಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಕಮಂಡರ್ ವ್ಯಾವಹಾರಿಕ ಲೋವರ್ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ರಿಯಾಲಿಟಿ ವಾಟ್ ಟು ಟಾಕ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಪ್ರಾಡಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಚಿತ್ತ ಅಹಂಕಾರ ಸೂಕ್ಷ್ಮ ಶರೀರಂ ಬೈ ಪ್ರಾಡಕ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಹುಚ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಇಸ್ ವ್ಯಾವಹಾರಿಕ ದೆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಸೂಕ್ಷ್ಮ ಶರೀರಂ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಉಪಾಧಿ ಆಲ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ ಫ್ಯಾಕಲ್ಟೀಸ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಇನ್ ತತ್ವಬೋಧ ಮನಸ್ಸು ಬುದ್ಧಿ ಚಿತ್ತ ಅಹಂಕಾರ ಪಂಚ ಪ್ರಾಣಾದಯ ಪಂಚ ಕರ್ಮೇಂದ್ರಿಯಾಣಿ ಪಂಚ ಜ್ಞಾನೇಂದ್ರಿಯಾಣಿ ಆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದೆಮ್ ಪುಟ್ ಟು ಗೆದರ್ ಪರಿಣಾಮ ಇಸ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ನೆಗೇಟ್ ಅನಾತ್ಮ ನಂಬರ್ ಟು ವಿಸ ಅನಾತ್ಮ ನಂಬರ್ ಒನ್ ಈಸ್ ಸ್ಥೂಲ ಶರೀರಂ ಅನಾತ್ಮ ನಂಬರ್ ಟು ಈ ಸೂಕ್ಷ್ಮ ಶರೀರಂ ಪ್ಯಾಕೇಜ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರತಿಷೇಧಾಯ ಟು ನೆಗೇಟ್ ದಟ್ ಆಹ ದ ಟೀಚಿಂಗ್ ಫಾಲೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಏಯ್ತ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ to explain that alone this uh, drugdrishya viveka sakshi sakshya viveka sakshyam as long as sakshyam is there the mind buddhi chitta ahankara sakshyam drug number 1 is sakshyam for drug number 2 the sakshi original i higher i real i non changing i you have to pratishet you have to falsify what drik number 1 you have to falsify lower i not by destroying the drik number 1 which is along with the buddhi mind sense organs etc body mind complex medium is required make use of pot and say there is no pot make use of pot and say there is no pot like that make use of the medium body mind complex sukshma shariram ashritya <laughs> sukshma shariram ashritya itself taking the support of res- uh, resorting to by superimposition adhyaropa we have to do what you have to do negate what you have to negate drik number 1 you have to negate who is drik number 1 lower i is it real or unreal unreal why it is vyavaharikam lower order of reality satta bheda i the original consciousness i am paramarthika satyam never changing ever the illuminator ever the experiencer never the experienced we saw all this in the last class but deliberately i am repeating parinama prashe pratishedhaya that parinama you see changing drik drik number 1 parinama therefore nishedhaya pratishedhaya means to falsify aha now i'll introduce the 58th verse this is the whole thing is introduction what a terse teaching in this you see now 58 esha sarvadhiya amrutam avilupte kadarshanah vikshate vikshamanopi nimishat ಸುರೇಶ್ವರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಶೋಯಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ದಿ ಸಾಕ್ಷಿ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಆಮ್ ಅವಿಲುಪ್ತ ನೆವರ್ ನೆವರ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಎನಿ ಎನಿ ನಾನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಎಟ್ ಎನಿ ಟೈಮ್ ಐ ನೆವರ್ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರ್ ಲುಪ್ತ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರೆನ್ಸ್ disappearance 
Avilupta means never disappear. Ever available consciousness. I am ever available consciousness. Sakshi Chaitanyam. Aviluptaha. How many, how many Sakshi Chaitanyams are there? Only one Atma Chaitanyam. OC is one. There are no many OCs. There are many RCs, but uh, one OC which is all pervading as Brahman. All bodies, stool and sukshma shriyams are mediums and reflecting mediums. So I am original consciousness, Brahman, I am one. Ekam Brahma. Ekam Sat Vipra Bahudha Vadanti. Many people talk about this Atma which is Ekaha. Ekaha Devaha Sarva Bhutesh Gudaha. Shrita Shvetar Upanishad. We saw in our sadhana camp. Eko Devaha. Who is that Devaha? Divyati Prakashati. Swayam Prakasha Swarupam Devaha Atma Chaitanyam I am Sarva Bhutesh Godaha I am in all bodies in all bodies in everybody in every body I am I am Ekaha look into the sloka Ekaha Abhiluptaha Darshanaha, it is shown, it is presented without any absence. Ekaha means non-dual. Darshanaha means swarupam, atma swarupam. Ever the seer, never the seen. Ever the experiencer, never the experienced. So, Druk number one is experienced by Druk number two. Therefore, ever the experiencer, ever the illuminator, this Atma, Chaitanyam, original consciousness, avikshamanopi vikshate, even though I am not really speaking, even witnesser also, I am not the experiencer. Experiencer number two, experiencer, uh, observer number two or knower number two, original I, avikshamanaha. Really, I don't see. Why? I don't have eyes. How can I see? How can I hear? I don't have ears. Therefore, Shabda, Sparsha, Rupa cannot reach me. I am Achakshuhu, Ashrotram. Apanihi apadam, I am. Therefore, vikshate as it were. Avikshamanopi vikshate. Yeshaha sarva dhyam ruttam. Vikshate kim? What I observe? I the drik number two or sakshi chaitanyam. Episode number two, sakshi chaitanyam, higher I, O, C, vikshate. Observe. What I observe? What I experience? Even though I am not an experiencer, I experience as it were. What? Nruttam. Sarva dhyam. Nruttam. Dance of the mind. Thoughts. Mental thoughts. Changing thoughts. I observe. Drik number one is observed by me. Nrittam means a dance. Sarvadhyam, all mental thoughts are observed by me. O C. Avikshamanopi Sarvadhyam Ruttam Eshaha Sakshi Chaitanyam Vikshate. I am Adruvaha. I am, sorry, I am uh, Dhruvam. Dhruvaha, Adhruvam, Nimishatu, Tatu, Nrittam, Vikshate. That Anvaya we have to do properly. Dhruvaha, Sakshi. Dhruvaha, Sakshi. 
वाट ऐ डू साक्षी तत् अवीक्षमाणी तत् ध्रुव तुवो ध्रुव इज देर हाउ टू स्प्लीट सेकेंड लाइन लास्ट वर्ड तत् एंड निमिषत एंड अध्रुव थ्री आर् एडक्टिव नृत्य वीक्षते ध्रुव साक्षी वी हेव टू सप्लै हू इज ध्रुव साक्षी साक्षी इज वाट दृक् नंबर टू दृक् नंबर टू इज अनचेजिंग नेवर द सेम नेवर चेंजिंग दट साक्षी ध्रुव साक्षी तुव इज देर ए हाट तुवो ध्रुव मीन तुव ध्रुव साक्षी तत् निमिषत निमिषत अध्रुव चेंजिंग ऑल द टाइम अध्रुव चेंजिंग थॉट्स ईवन दो ई एम नॉट रियली सीयिंग एज दो सीयर ई एम एज दो अबर्वर एज दो ई एम डूइंग ऑल एक्शन कर्तृत्वादि भोक्तृत्वादि All are unreal. My kartrutva, my bhuktrutva are unreal. That's why Lord Krishna said in Bhagavad Gita, "Tasse kartaram apimam vidhi akartaram abhyayam." I am as the doer, as the enjoyer. Tasse kartaram apimam vidhi akartaram abhyayam. Understand, I am not the doer. From what standpoint? साक्षी चैतन्य स्टैंड पॉइंट फर्स्ट एपिसोड स्टैंड पॉइंट दृक् नंबर टू स्टैंड पॉइंट देर फोर आश्रित दट अनित्य अध्रुव मीन अनित्य ऑल सर्वधिया नृत्य ऑल मेंटल थॉट्स डांसिंग इन नाटक दीप प्रकरण मालसो वीसा इन पंचदशी सर्व धिया मीन बुद्धि चिता अहंकार ऑल दो मेंटल थॉट्स यू कैन टेक दे आर् लाइक डांसिंग डांसर्स एवरी थॉट इज ए डांसर डिफरेंट डिफरेंट कॉस्ट्यूम्स दे वेर रागा कॉस्ट्यूम्स द्वेषा कॉस्ट्यूम राग द्वेष कामा कॉस्ट्यूम्स वन वन थॉट वन वन type of costume morning one type of costume afternoon one type of costume vesham mind is changing nrutam dhiya nrutam means mental thoughts dance of those mental thoughts dancing thoughts sakshi aham vikshate aham sakshi aham dhruvah sakshi अहम यू हाव टू सप्लाई साक्षी मीन संबड़ी संबड़ी शुड नाट टेक ई दि हय्यर ई ओरजनल ई कॉन्शियने ई एम ध्रुव साक्षी तत् निमिषत अध्रुव नृत्य वीक्षते सो दट निमिषत निमिषत मीन आलवेज चेंजिंग चेंजिंग साक्षी ने seeing all this uh, changing even though i am not a seer as no seer i am as no observer as no experience uh, higher i i hope i have communicated so i am the observer druk we say in initial stages that druk you have to forget now druk number 1 is false i come to druk number 2 which is really speaking sakshi so now what <coughs> next next verse 59th verse introduction we will look into that page next page page number 68 वर्स नंबर फिफ्टी नाइन इंट्रडक्षन
ஐ வில் ரீட் த இன்ட்ரடக்ஷன் உபோத்தாத்த அனுபந்தோக்தி வை காலிட் வை காலிட் அஸ் உபோத்தாத்தம் டு த நெக்ஸ்ட் வெர்ஸ் வாட் இஸ் திஸ் வெரி பிக் உபோத்தாத்தம் ஓகே ननु सर्वसिद्धांतानामपी उपपन्नत्वात्तरेतरदृष्ट्यापेक्षया சர்வதார்க்கிகைவாயாமாய்ஸ்வராச்சாரிய A poor of Pakshis raise a question with the objection, Nanu. Nanu what? Nanu. What is that brief uh, um, gist I will give about this? Later we will see the answer of Sureshwara Acharya from Vuchyate onwards answer. These uh, up to here what I read. Uh, சம்பாவயாமக அப் டு தேர் பூரபக்ஷிஸ் அப்ஜெக்ஷன் வாட் பூரபக்ஷி வாண்ட் டு சே ஐ டோன்ட் ஃபைண்ட் எனி சிஸ்டம் ஆஃப் ஃபிலாசபி ஆர் ஸ்கூல் ஆஃப் தாட் ஹேவிங் அரைவ்டேட் ஃபைனாலிட்டி த ரியாலிட்டி ஐ டோன்ட் ஃபைண்ட் we are telling atma ekaha shuddhaha buddhaha muktaha and atma is asangaha sakshi chaitanyam is asanga swarupam all pervading brahman this atma chaitanyam or sakshi chaitanyam is uh, the witness uh, witness of all changes ratta விக்ஷம அவிக்ஷமானே விக்ஷதே யூ ஆர் டெல்லிங் நைஸ் அண்ட் சாட்சி சைத்தன்யம் டசன்ட் ஹாவ் எனி சம்சார கர் கரெக்ட் ஃபைன் ஃபைன் எட் த்ரீ பீரியட்ஸ் ஆஃப் டைம் சாட்சி இஸ் ஃப்ரீ ஃப்ரம் சம்சார ப்ராப்ளம் அண்ட் தி சாட்சி சைத்தன்யம் விஸ் இட் இஸ் ஐடென்டிக்கல் வித் ஆல் பர்வீடிங் பிரம்மன் ஆல் திஸ் ஆர் அபவுட் சாட்சி கிரேட்னஸ் சாட்சி சைத்தன்யம் i the atma original consciousness my greatness this is i am asangaha chidrupaha wonderful to listen there is no controversy about atma chaitanyam in all systems of philosophy they all accept astika systems and nastika systems all of them accept consciousness but its nature there are differences everyone accept astika uh, sankhya yoga nyaya vaisheshika purva mimamsa uttara mimamsa astika darshanams all of them accept consciousness what consciousness this type of consciousness asangaha asamsari consciousness atma chaitanyam they all accept even nastika darshanams also buddha uh, buddhism shunyavada everything that vijnanavada buddhism they accept bip bip consciousness you know chenika uh, vijnanavadi accept consciousness but charvaka also take atma the body as atma charvaka also included in nastika matam there is no controversy in acceptance of atma the consciousness chaitanya but uh, their view regarding this consciousness what type of consciousness what is the nature of consciousness what are the characteristics of consciousness what is this uh, swarupam 
in this in the swarupam of consciousness there are lot of differences in 12 school of thoughts we saw in brahma sutra second chapter second pada avirodhadhyaya all systems we saw that uh, point we are seeing briefly here those who have done brahma sutra study for them it is easy what purapakshi says this every school of thought uh, they have their own views they say my view alone is correct other school of thought views are incorrect they are not right they are false that's what gaudapadarya acharya said in mandukya upanishad also parasparam virudhyante they quarrel each other they negate each other each school of thought uh, look down upon other school of thought each school of th- thought defends his own view and takes offensive arguments and defensive arguments each philosophy how to arrive at the truth then each one is presenting their view and rejecting the others view other school of thought other system of philosophy other siddhanta then as a a uh, listener as a reader as the, uh, how to understand whom i have to accept whom i have to accept which one is r- real how can i arrive at finality the ultimate truth how can i arrive ramanujacharya visishta advaitam philosophy is correct or madhvacharya advaita siddhanta is correct or sankhya siddhanta is correct or nyaya siddhanta is correct which one is correct how can i arrive at the final reality the truth pura pakshi says no i am not able to find out <coughs> i am not able to get any conclusion because everyone says i am right and everyone rejects the other <coughs> itare tar apekshayana therefore for that uh, we have an answer for that for all controversies for all controversies of each system of philosophy there is a controversy because they are rejecting the other astika darshanam sir one is rejecting the other nastika darshanam also nobody is accepting other system of philosophy what we say <coughs> the siddhanta the final conclusion the finality the reality you arrive at where there is no controversy non controversial ever ever uh, supportive and at three periods of time never lose its uh, um, truth under any circumstances and by any arguments there is a method for every school of thought there is a method even science they have a method to arrive at the conclusion a theory what are the methods they follow for example we take you know there is if there is a controversy or big debate suppose sureshwar acharya is going to say if there is a controversy or big debate is going on there must be a uh, some method one method there must be one method for what there must be one method to settle the controversy to settle the all controversies controversial arguments so in every field they have their own um, method to establish their school of thought is correct they have their own method whether that is uh, ultimately correct or not that is a different thing that everybody is having their method for example we take science 
um, the analysis um, how they solve the problem what they do that in science in scientific exploration in uh, scientific uh, debate how they do any analysis how they arrive at any conclusion first they do observation in that method one method there are steps observation but then next out of that observation they take some data collecting the data point number 2 collecting the data from that data collected data they project the theory they project their own theory based on their data based on that data they project their theory second third step based on that projected theory they have to predict the uh, new conclusion new theory hmm? based on that projected theory they have to predict project and predict there is difference okay based on that projected based on that projection based on what data data based on what observation observation data projection then prediction after prediction of a new conclusion new theory again they have to do observation again they have to do observation this is the method they follow in science in any field they have this type of analysis now the poor pakshi here uh, says what look into the portion now nanu i have an objection here i cannot sarva siddhantanam api even all siddhanta sankhya yoga nyaya vaisheshika puro mimamsa all siddhantas are sarva siddhantanam api swasva drishtya apekshaya from their own standpoint swasva drishtya apekshaya swasva drishti means from their own standpoint upapannatva their view is depending upon their own standpoint by rejecting the other standpoints even some of the scientific uh, inventions are proved by after the uh, scientist death they say swami ji says uh, even einstein <coughs> uh, einstein's uh, um, some of the inventions um, um, they are discovered later the light bending light bending of the science, uh, einstein's view is uh, come to conclusion after einstein's death it seems yes, that uh, they say <coughs> they proved after the death of einstein like that they never stop they go on and on doing that observations continuation taking place therefore here observation in science in shastra we use what that sureshwara acharya gives answer later now what puru pakshi says all this swasva drishti apekshaya swasva means from their own from their view of standpoint from their standpoint from their view only apekshaya from that standpoint upapannatva they have come to conclusion they have arrived at this conclusion because of their own view itare itara drishtya apekshaya from you see from the others standpoint apekshaya dusthita siddhatvad dusthita means it is not correct from the other systems of philosophies na ekatrapi vishwasam pashyamaha i don't find any conclusion vishwasaha eva na pashyama i am not able to accept which one to accept because that is rejected by the other system of philosophy when i go to that philosophy again that is rejected by the other therefore vishwasam na pashyamaha नच सर्वतार्किकूषित 
samarthitam sarva tarkiko pavadrava upas apasarpanaya i don't find any marga vartama na sambhavayamah sambhavayamah i don't find any marga path to see to find out unrejected non controversial siddhant i am not able to find out so i will explain these words in the next class om purnamada purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate purnasya purnamadaya purnamevavashishyate om shanti 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 हरि ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नमः हरि ओम